morning, it is Friday the 21st of December 2018. This is the local news for today. Culture icon died last Wednesday. More housing projects to be implemented in 2019 and parking problems in the inner city. Culture icon James Ramlal passed away last Wednesday. The death of both Ramlal and Michael Slory is a huge loss for Suriname and then mainly for the culture community, so says Elfira Sandi, the director of the culture department. Both men had, each in their specific areas, achievements that no one can ignore. James Ramlal has made an important contribution to the realization of the Nola Hatterman Art Academy. He also contributed to the cultural integration in the region. Ramlal had led Surinamese delegations for several times to the Kari Festa festivals. James Ramlal was 83 years old. The government's policy remains focused on creating even more possibilities for people needy to have their own roof over their head. Minister Christine Polak of Social Affairs said that in this context, uh, that in 2019 nationwide, more housing projects will be implemented. In 2019, the ministry will offer the possibility to house seekers to register online. The project that was announced earlier, earlier will be carried out the coming year. 2018 has been very challenging for the Ministry of Social Affairs. Among others, the implementation of the Moni Carta for the payment of social benefits. The Ministry is also planning to apply innovative opportunities for the interior when it comes to paying social benefits. And we're approaching the end of the year and the crowds in the inner city are already increasing. Not only the traffic jams, but the lack of parking space downtown is even more visible. Often the choice is made to park in front of a store or office. Humphrey Narden, head of the PR department of the police force, is familiar with the parking issue and says that it is important to know where to park or not. People that park incorrectly will be fined and the vehicle can also be towed away. Narden also says that when driving, traffic should not be impeded either. And that concludes the local news for today. Have a wonderful and pleasant weekend. Until Monday, bye-bye.